Hi everyone, you Beach Chronicles of the Grey here, Diva. If this is your first time, welcome. If not, welcome back. For all of you out there, hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so that every time I upload a video, you will be notified. Hit the like button, chat with me in the comments, and when I get an opportunity, I will chat back. And share my video with your friends and family so that they can come to my channel and get to know me also. I'm here today with my quick update on Celebrity Big Brother. If you're not watching, on demand it, catch up. It's really good this season. So I didn't do my recap for last episode, but I'm going to wrap them all up together. The only thing I want to say about the last episode previous to the one that happened tonight is I love Cynthia. I love Carson and they're like a couple in the house. OK, but those two together are dangerous and disastrous because last week they just handed over the game to Todrick and Nisa. They put it in a nice bowl. They packaged it up and they said, here you go. Take the $250,000. I don't know which one of you are going to win it, but I'm giving it to the both of y'all. Y'all figure it out who's going to win. They gave them the game. So they had the opportunity to get the strongest player out the building. And they got suckered by Todrick. Todrick came to them with this cockamamie story about Shayna saying how Shayna was a double agent and wanted them out the house. Cynthia fell for it, hook and sink. Then because Carson um, trusts Cynthia, she goes to Carson and said, look, this chick has been a, 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 a double playing us the whole time. We can't trust her. We need to backdoor her and get her out the house. Um, Shayna tried to talk sense into Cynthia and listen I love Cynthia but you, 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 Cynthia was just just being ridiculous it was like no 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 you're a traitor and wouldn't even uh, uh, half believe Shayna and I'm saying to myself um, Carson, okay, maybe Cynthia is being a little off right now, but when you have a couple, um, when one is weak, the other got to be strong, but that's why I'm saying those two are disastrous together because one was weak and the other one was weaker. So Carson comes and he believes Cynthia cause she believes them and believes the whole story. And the person who has been trying to kick Carson out the house since the moment she laid eyes on him, Carson saves her. Because he believes her and Todrick ridiculous story. And poor Shayna, I felt so bad for her. I, I just thought they did her so dirty. So dirty. But she got kicked out the house. And my thing is, she is going to be a juror, people. Um, try to be partially nice to her. Try to act like you care. But no, you just pretty much told her we don't believe you. And you are going to be the one that gets kicked out this house. So yes, she gave up. The whole house is against me. I might as well leave and go home. But these two, C and C, Cynthia and Carson, gave the game away. So here we are tonight. I'm sitting there chilling. I'm trying to figure out what's going to happen, what's going to go on. Let me see who's going to win this head of household. And Sleeping Beauty, the underdog, the one that since he came in the house, all he did was sleep, take a nap, wake up, go back to sleep, and take another nap. He has won nothing up until this point. Four people. Is it four people? Teddy got kicked out the house. Shayna got kicked out the house. Chris Kirkpatrick got kicked out the house. And Chris Kattan just left. So four people. Todd has done nothing but existed in the house, eating his food, chilling, laying back, and not getting his hands dirty at all, was in no alliances. And here it is tonight. He wins the head of household. I'm like, where, 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 how did this happen? Where, where, where did this come from? Who say they so? He got every single drink, right? The taste in every single drink. He wins at a household. And who does he put up on the block? Yet again, Carson. Not the strongest person in the house. Okay? Because this is the first um, game that you won, Todd. When you say to yourself... I know I had an alliance with Misa, but you know what? She's a strong player. I need to get her out of here. But no, you put up Carson and you put up Lamar. Now, granted, Lamar, I don't even think he's aware that he's in the Big Brother house. He doesn't know the game. Um, he didn't want to be a mascot. But right now, Lamar, you needed to be benched because 
every you another one. You did not win not one single game. Uh, come on, Lamar. You're the athlete here. You even said yourself, you're the player. But you have won nothing. You, you... Anyway, guys. Celebrity Big Brother. I'm loving it. Todd came out of nowhere. And he did a sneak attack on us. And he tasted those drinks. And he got every single last thing correct. Now, it's going to be... Oh, this is what I want to say. Cynthia... She's a little delusional. And remember, guys, I truly, truly like Cynthia. But she's a little delusional. When Cynthia wants to go to Carson and say, listen, um, the veto is up to me now to win the veto. Well, um, Cynthia, let's wake you up for um, 1.2 seconds, Sue. You're another one. You have yet to win anything. So now you really think you stand a chance of winning this veto. And then once you win, taking Carson off the block. Um, good luck with that, Cynthia. It, unfortunately, you're definitely going to get kicked out the house. Because if you don't win this veto, they're definitely voting Carson out the house. Because the only vote that he would get to say would come from you. And so Cynthia, just like Todrick, went around making sure his boo didn't get kicked out the house. Instead of you accepting the fact that Carson is on the block, you should be going around campaigning and making deals to get him in the, um, to keep him in the house. Matter of fact, just like Todrick told his messiness lie, you should be saying some mess about somebody so that Carson can come off the block and someone else can go up there as a sacrificial lamb and get kicked out. So Carson's life is dependent on Cynthia. And um, I'm just going to cry now because I already know how that's going to go. Carson is getting kicked out. Unless by some miracle, some angels in heaven come down and help Cynthia win a game. We're saying bye to Carson. Well, anyway, guys, I hope you're watching Celebrity Big Brother. I'm loving it. And if you're watching, who do you think is going to win this thing? I, I, I'm still, my vote was really for Carson. Um, I'm hoping by a miracle, and it would be an absolute miracle, that Cynthia wins this veto. And when Cynthia wins the veto, she can take Carson off the block. And then Todd is going to have to put someone else up there. So right now, I'm hanging in there, guys. And I'm, my vote is for um, Carson. I wanted Carson and Cynthia to be the last two. But they messed that up themselves. So I can't be mad at anybody but those two. So if Carson gets kicked out, my next vote goes to Cynthia. If Cynthia gets kicked out... Um, my next vote goes to Lamar, even though he doesn't have a clue what's going on. He doesn't know where he's at, why he's here, and what time it is, but I'm still going to lean towards him. And then, if not him, then the three that's left, it doesn't matter to me which one of them will win. But I'm telling you that Shayna, she has a torch to burn. So, even if Cynthia and Carson... Um, was left as the last two I don't think she she probably just be like I'm not casting a vote for either one of them to get the money so Todrick is in trouble if he's one of the last ones um, in the house because he's definitely not going to get Shayna vote and if Shayna gets in the ear of the other jurors then um, um, he definitely will get no one's vote and, and Misa the one who has been playing every single person in this house like a, a, a chess a chess piece since the moment she walked in the door is going to win the money so i'm guessing if it if it really comes down to strength and um, um you know who's the strongest then misa will definitely win because she played a mind game on them she not only won them over with her actual physical strength she played a mind game on them and and, and she trumped them all and then Todrick helped her trump them all. So I won't be surprised if they're the last two in the building. If it's Todd, I'm literally going to fall off my seat because I don't know who poked them, woke him up, and actually um, got him in this game. But you got to give it to him. The person who didn't do much work for four people getting kicked out 
towards the end and I guess that's all that matter who wins the last leg of the race race right so that's what Todd Bridges is doing well thanks guys for watching let me know um this video let me know if you're watching celebrity big brother chat with me in the comments and when I get an opportunity I will chat back who do you think is going to win this thing and take home the $250,000 don't forget to hit the like button and I'll see you in the next video